hey guys i am back with another video this time i am doing a christmas decor vlog okay guys so i decided to go ahead and do my own little decor i have my little garment this garment that you are seeing is what goes on top of my entertainment stand so i got the bowl from the dollar tree i got that ornament right there from hobby lobby so all the stuff in this video will be a little bit of dollar tree hobby lobby and joanne and walmart so i try to spend as less as possible for this christmas decor because i have a lot of decor in the storage so i didn't really want to buy a whole bunch of stuff and i wasn't going digging that storage because i can't put my christmas tree up or nothing like that anyway so this only little christmas tree i can i can fit in this place because it's so small and i got this christmas tree from walmart it was only like 18 dollars, and it's a fiber optic tree it actually is black which i meant to get a green but it's okay i just dealt with it because my kitchen decor is black also has black in it also so i'm like you know what and it's going to be going on the counter because it's so small i have no room for no christmas tree that's why i didn't get my christmas tree out of storage so um i just want to have a little christmas tree in my house because christmas is really one of my favorite seasons and holidays so i had to have some type of christmas vibe in my home okay so you see the, the entertainment stand with the, the um the um the garment on top and you see the tv where they have the little screen saver with the christmas tree a christmas theme and the music plan it has christmas music playing with it as well so this is me preparing my wreath that i got from joanne's it's the only thing i did get from joanne now the bowls and everything um the ribbon that you just seen i got from hobby lobby the bowls I got from Dollar Tree. I was actually surprised to find the the ribbon that matched the bowls, and I'm glad I did it Hobby Lobby. And um, but everything else that's on this wreath came from the Dollar Tree. And you can kind of tell that this this mesh here, whatever this stuff is right here, you kind of tell that came from Dollar Tree because when you cut it, it was kind of stringy, but it worked. It gave what it's supposed to have to gave. I think it turned out really good. Um, I'm happy with the way it turned out. So, you know, hey, like I said, I'm shopping on the budget. So, let me let you guys watch and see, um, you know, see me do this or whatever. Which is not, it's going to take a little minute. Seems like it's taking a little minute to do this thing on reach right here. Now, I ain't going to tell no story. It took a little second now. But it worked out. Now, you guys are going to have to tell me what you guys think about this wreath once you see it and once it get done. I would really like your opinion because this is my first time doing a wreath for christmas okay and it was kind of fun and it was kind of interesting and it was kind of huh i was very intrigued to find out how it was going to turn out you know what i'm saying but hey your girl did a, a all right little job honey and be honest be honest i could take correct the criticism okay so be honest with how you feel about this wreath honey once you see it done okay i promise you i want your opinion so that is the ribbon that I got from Hobby Lobby. So let's see y'all. I actually cut it a little bit too short though. So I had to, I had four pieces I had cut. So I had to put the other three to the side because it was too short. I, I did make that one work a little bit as much as I could. But the other, the other piece that's on there, I had to go ahead and cut another piece of ribbon. So I got three little extra short pieces, okay? I thought I had really measured it right, but I guess not. It was giving me some problems with trying to make it stay on, though. So, y'all, I used the pipe, um, what is it, pipeline kind of stuff to make the hook it, to make it stay, you know, to wrap around it. So, um, and that worked pretty good. Because, you know, practice make perfect. I'm going to, you know, practice on doing it. I might do it every year. I ain't going to be doing it throughout the year. So, it's going to take some practices, honey. <laughs> some years of practice, okay? Because it's going to be once a year that I'm going to be making a darn wreath. I'm not going to do that on the regular, okay? You see me back there, I'm talking mess about that, that that thing. 
All right, so you see how you guys see it turned out? Okay, I think it turned out pretty cute. Let me know again. Let me know what you think about that. I think it turned out cute for my first wreath, okay? Everything matched perfectly. So, I'm just saying, your girl did a good job. She did a good job. And this is my little gourmet, as I told y'all. And you see the, the screensaver on the TV? I think that is so cute. So I think they turned out good. Y'all see the, the flowers right there. I was going to put on the wreath, but they didn't fit the little gold flowers. But I think they turned out, they're kind of like more of a tan. They, they're like a, a suede, like a van, like velvet like type flowers. But they is cute. They're really cute. And they, that's my little small tree. And y'all see that little small furniture right there that I got from um, um Wayfair? Y'all, please don't ever shop at Wayfair because you is a, it's a waste of money. You see where it's dented in on that one seat? That's because the wood broke up on the bottom of it. So as soon as I move, I'm throwing it in the garbage. It is not going with me at all.